Good morning and welcome back and uh, let's play some chess. 50 minutes, 10 seconds increments, here we go. Let's see who we are playing today. All right, we have the black pieces against Matterhorn 66 from Switzerland. Another d4. No e4, e5. We have a queen's gambit, like yesterday. Let's see how that goes. So we take the pawn and we are trying to hold on to it. It looks like we are succeeding. So we have an extra pawn out of the opening. Marvelous. Well, that's nice. Let's get the knight out. We are putting pressure on that pawn. Here we go to the center. Of course, take stakes. We can do we take with the oh, okay he's going after my uh, I can go here I could also try and take this takes 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 if the bishop saves itself can i save my knight takes probably i can but if he takes i can maybe go for this kind of stuff uh do we want to go for it takes 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 and if he yeah that's funny uh and if he takes my queen I take the queen and if he saves the bishop I grab the pawn and I have rerouting possibilities right and if he takes my knights then I will take this one Oh, but that doesn't really work, I think, because it also attacks my rook. So, yeah, maybe it doesn't work because of takes, 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 he can take my rook, which I kind of overlooked. Um, but if I take, take, no, that doesn't work. Probably I'm going here. Uh, yeah, that doesn't work. That was a stupid decision. But at least uh, we have split the pawns. And um, yeah, we have made it interesting. Um, So let's take, remove a defender. Now he takes and he has to take back. Now his pawn structure is messed up. There we go. Well, it's uh, it's not that bad. <laughs> it's a crazy game. It is a crazy, crazy game, I think. We want to get castled. Or not. Uh, it's a little bit dangerous, but we are building and we are trying to open up uh, open up the king there. Uh, 
let's try and open up the king this is a funky game yeah he's trying to set up uh, some nasty stuff uh, regarding my rook so here here I go here that's good enough because here I am already ready to double up yes all right interesting game yes now my queen has access and this queen is blocked in which is nice now if you push by I will uh, take no he's not ah, he's trying to set something up uh, so yeah so I think let's try and open it up uh, that makes sense um, Hmm, how do we want to do this? What do I want to do with my knight? That's also a question. I would like to have my knight here, to be honest, but it it's going to take a couple of moves for some protection maybe I want to activate my queen and then he has options to uh, to take actually so maybe what we want to do we take first we take once See how he recaptures. So he takes with the uh, with the pawn. That gives me options to go here, maybe activate the rook. Um, let's go ahead. Let's double up. Put pressure here. And we need to somehow use the knight to protect the king. We need some protection. Oh, he's pushing, he's opening it up. Wow. He's not afraid of anything. Uh, okay. Well, let's take. He's not afraid. Because of bishop takes rook here. And there's a pin going on. Of course he can go with the rook, but then maybe I have moves like that. Or I can take the pawn. So yeah, I don't know.
this I just take or right here I just take the bishop of course right now the bishop is hanging so he castles uh, but I can take here with check yeah I will take with check uh, Or I just take the bishop now. The queen is up front, but I think I, I'm 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 starting with this one. I mean, it's just a free pawn with check. Wow! <laughs> wow! This is not very good. And this is not very good. All right. Let's see what our opponent is going to do here. Maybe he resigns. Maybe not. Mutterhorn 66 from Switzerland. What are you going to do? If you're blocking, I will take and win a piece and be happy. I've got three connected past pawns. I don't know. I don't know. All right. So. Yeah, I think I will take. There we go. Huh. Is she going to sacrifice the queen for two rooks? That's maybe the best he can do. And I need to solve my back rank issues. I can solve them with uh, developing a knight. Yeah, I don't see a lot of other good moves. Um, if he moves the queen, I will just take the rook. Yeah, I don't know. I I I don't know. I don't know what he can do. I don't know. My queen can always go back as well for the back ranker. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah. Well, I don't think... Uh, This 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 is not how a queen's gambit, the client goes uh, normally, but we went a little bit fun, fun, funky today. Oh boy. Yeah. But uh, yeah, sometimes funky works. All right. Time for Palo Santo. While we wait for our opponent to make a move. Um, yeah. I hope he's not going to, to run the clock down for 10 minutes. I 
I think his best shot is to sacrifice the queen for two rooks. Then two rooks is still two rooks. I mean, I do have a knight as well. And those pass pawns, eh? Those pass pawns are a nightmare. All right. What other moves can he do? I don't know. Maybe here or yeah. I I honestly don't know. If he goes here, I will just exchange all the rooks and force a queen trade. And that's it. Mm, I will cut this out with the video if this is really going to be eight minutes of nothing. Yeah, I really don't know. I don't see a lot of good tactics. No, this is a disaster. This is an opening disaster, this. Yeah. I don't think he should have castled. Um, in this position maybe even wait with this move maybe you, you know this is so obvious maybe he could have waited with it also i don't think i, I don't know if this is the best place for the bishop blocks in the rook i don't know i i don't know what he could have done here i think i would have played here keep the king in the center you know get the bishop in front and I don't know. But yeah, how are you going to involve the other rook in the attack? Um, or maybe maybe castling isn't that bad. Or maybe bishop here castle and get the king on h1. And double rooks on the g file. I don't know. We need some attacking players to put. Uh, a good game plan here. That pawn push that helped me opening up uh, where his king was. Um, but yeah, on the other hand, yeah, I don't know. Maybe here, 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 trying to get his pieces over. Yeah, here he's, uh, this is over. All right, well, it was a fun game for today. Let's check his uh, accounts. I mean, we have to do something in the meantime. Oh, he's a bullet player, he plays a lot of bullets. Maybe that's why the opening went so fast. Well, we played fast as well, eh? Now he's also uh, playing a lot of a lot of rapids as well. He plays a lot of things. He's a uh, multiplayer. So bullets, rapids. His highest rating was thirty sixty nine, and now he is. 3069, so he's at his peak rating. Hmm. No, I took away his peak rating. Blitz, 884. Puzzle, his best survival, 34. And his puzzle rating, 1993. I hear, I hear something. Yes, yeah, so he sacrifices the queens for two rooks. 
which is probably the best uh, decision. So here, here is the idea, I guess. Maybe here. Um, so he made a move. He made a move. All right. Yeah, I think I think we want to involve the knight. And he's probably going to double up. That is probably what he is going to do. Um, yeah, and then I have to make some Lufts. He can go here. Actually. But maybe then I have this move. So let's start by this one. No back rank. Then we are making Lufts. I think this is enough or maybe this. Uh, this is a move threatening checkmates. If he doubles up, yes, I think we have to make Lufts to make sure we are not getting checkmated here. Now here I thought I had this move. No. This is check, picking up a rook. And then it really is over. Uh, takes. Um, I can simplify, but that there's no need to simplify it in that extent. Let's uh, grab another pawn. I could go here and use uh, all my pawns to make a new queen. I was wondering what my opponent was doing for so long. Maybe just thinking about all the possibilities. Uh, check. Maybe he's giving me checkmate. Maybe, if you are nice. Nope, no checkmate for me. Then we, do we take the pawn or do we have mates? No, he resigns. Okay. Was this mate? No. All right, let's check the analysis. Weird game. We play with 88.2 against 73.2. Um, yeah, queens, gambits. We want a pawn out of the opening, which is always good. That is a fine move. And let me check if this is working. Yeah, this is winning. This is winning. Yep, because I get the knight out. That's the difference. So and if rook takes, king takes. I can't castle, but I'm up a piece. And if bishop goes back, we grab a pawn. Yep, and our knight gets out. Right, yep. Oh, we even have bishop. Bishop takes to mess up the... I, will, I, will, I, I wouldn't take that, I think. I would come here. Here. And I'm totally fine. Yes. And what I didn't saw, what I overlooked in this variation, was takes, takes, and I thought I had this. This is a tactic you have in the Carol Khan a lot of the times, but... My rook is hanging, and that I overlooked in my first 
first uh, calculation. So, but okay, takes, takes, and here, trying to remove a defender, he didn't fall for it, so takes, takes. Now his pawn structure is all messed up. And I try to open it up. C5, it's not that bad, it's the third engine move. It likes developing the knight first. I just want to get rid of the C pawn. Now while I can. And take stakes. Yep. Computer likes this. But then I will just take takes takes this is what I would have done probably I will lose the pawn but I'm okay with it this is a winning king and pawn endgame even without the knight I have these two connectors it's an easy win yeah queen takes d5 is the best move and then knight c6, yep, yep, making Lufts. And then rook 1 to d2. And uh, yeah, that's it. Mm, that's not even best. Oh, I had made in 6. Yeah, you know, this is simple chess. Ah, here. Ah. Oh, that's better. That is better. Uh, is it? Yeah. This is mates. Huh. Well, interesting game. Let's uh, leave it. Uh, leave it like that. All right, I want to thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Please like, subscribe, leave a comment. I would really appreciate it. And I hope I will see you back tomorrow for a new game. Goodbye.